What's up, everybody? It's AJ with eTrailer.com. Today, we're going to be checking out these WeatherTech floor mats on this 2020 Chevrolet Traverse. So these are going to be the floor mats. This style is going to have a plastic core and a rubberized outside. So they keep their form very well, and they even clip in here at the bottom. They give you a good fit and custom fit for your Traverse. I'm going to peel it up and show you the bottom here. You see that's the portion that clips in to the bottom of your floor. You push it in that easily you can see it moves around a little bit because there's not really nibs under there at all but those clipped in keep it in spot in the same space so you don't worry about shifting around underneath you we're going a little closer at the floor mat more towards the center here now this portion doesn't have any structure underneath it so you can see i can push it down which is fine it still protects your floor it does better than your oem floor mats that usually don't come out as far as this does you can see how it comes to the door jam here However, with this portion, when we poured water on it, we tested it earlier today, poured some water on it, it didn't exactly come down to the reservoir as it does on some of the other floor mats, but it still keeps it from going on your interior, which is the whole point of this. Now, with that custom fit, you can see it goes around here very nicely. It fits right in. I like the side, high side walls here and the high wall up front that goes well above the pedals. So don't have to worry about if you did miss, miss your pedal, you're not stepping on the carpet. So if you had something on your shoe, you wouldn't get there. It's still got protection. And you can see the points that it's clipped in. As I push up and down on it, it does shift a little bit, but it's not gonna move a whole bunch. So it's not gonna slide up underneath your pedals or anything when you're driving. Now this passenger side, when you look at it, doesn't have the clips like the driver's side does, but it still sp stays in place pretty well. You can see now I've put it down in there and I'm shifting it back and forth. I'm pulling on it pretty good and it's still staying right there. Sure, it shifts just a little bit, but you don't have to worry about this coming out on this side either. We have grooves in this side too and a reservoir, which the reservoir is more for like catching drinks that spill because it's right here next to the center console. We have the upper portion here and that's good for like scraping your boots off and getting some of the dirt away from your pedals. More on the driver's side for that one, but just helping scrape it off so when you get out of the vehicle. Now looking at how it goes over the door jam, does not affect the door. I can open and close that a couple times show you it's not really an issue but another thing to notice is the WeatherTech logo here it does stick out pretty well the other HP Weathercraft floor mats it's just a logo here so it's not as big as that because it can collect a little bit of water so if that's something that kind of sticks out that you don't like there is other options overall I think it's a great fit for your traverse it's going to help you not have to clean the interior because that's what it's all about now I will point out some other things with WeatherTech. There is other options out there. Make sure you use the fit guide to get the right fit for your vehicle on your Traverse. For instance, it's a big difference. You have seven or eight seats. So make sure you use the fit guide to figure that out so you get the right mats. And if you want ones that go with the front, they do also make the second row and third row ones as well. So check those out on the website too. Well, I think that does it. Thanks for hanging out and I hope this helped.